One part of the first phase of the reopening that does include Palm Beach, Broward, and Miami-Dade is elective surgeries, which resume today across the state. Ari Hyde has more tonight from two local doctors who say getting back into the ER is vital to the health of South Florida. Much of the focus when it comes to the reopening of Florida has been on restaurants and retail shops, things like golf courses. But there was a major change on Monday here at hospitals as doctors were once again allowed to perform elective surgeries. Dr. Joseph Ricotta sat down with us Monday evening after a day in the operating room where he had performed an elective surgery for the first time in more than a month. In the vascular population, it's, it's, uh, it's been an issue. Dr. Ricotta is a vascular surgeon at Delray Medical Center. His patients have issues with blood flow in their bodies. Like everybody else, Dr. Ricotta's ER was closed for elective surgeries for the last six weeks because of COVID-19. Patients are sitting at home, not leaving their houses, and the disease is progressing. And Dr. Ricotta says that's been an issue. Patients with relatively minor problems have become patients with major problems. If we can take care of them on an elective basis, then they don't become an emergency. For Dr. Scott Norris, no elective surgeries has meant a lack of comfort for his patients. They've been very understanding in delaying their surgery, even though it's been affecting their quality of life. Dr. Norris is an orthopedic surgeon at Palm Beach Gardens Medical Center. Knee replacements, hip replacements, they've all been postponed as the state fights COVID-19. They're back now, along with policies, keeping COVID-19 patients separate from everyone else for safety. Well, right now, I think the hospital is probably one of the safest places to be. Patients are more likely to get infected with the virus if they go to the grocery store or go pump some gas than they are to come to the hospital. And all patients who come to Palm Beach Gardens Medical Center or Delray Medical Center for an elective surgery will be screened for COVID-19. And if necessary, you also may get a test. If there are any concerns, those surgeries could be postponed. Ari Hyde, WPBF 25 News. Our thanks to